The foot traffic at Rutgers University's Newark campus was pretty light on Thursday afternoon, but the conversation was heavy on one topic. There's actually a lot of students that want to go back online, and then there's a lot of students that can't handle another lockdown. It's an idea not a lot of us want to think about. An uptick in COVID cases on college campuses in the area now giving rise to the possibility of new mandates and moving classes online. It's already a reality for students at Princeton University, where in the last week of the semester, undergraduate final exams were shifted to a remote format. The university also issued a mandate where students will be required to get a booster shot in order to return for the spring semester. While no official announcement has been made by Rutgers, it's something students are already mulling over. Obviously, it definitely sucks, but like, I'd rather play it safe and and not have to like worry worry about even catching it in the first place. It's kind of scary because like you can't really tell what's going to happen next. While some institutions are taking matters into their own hands, others are waiting for more guidance from the CDC to redefine what it means to be fully vaccinated. A mandate on boosters is inevitable, according to Dr. Anthony Santella, professor at the School of Health Sciences at the University of New Haven. We've told our community, both students and employees, that the writing is on the wall. This will happen, so it's in your best interest uh, to get the booster as soon as you become eligible. While Governor Murphy said it's too soon to issue a similar mandate at public and state colleges, getting a booster is being strongly encouraged by school officials at all New Jersey colleges. With cases on the rise, more than 6,200 new positive cases reported on Thursday alone, the governor has said every option remains on the table. In Newark, I'm Andrew Ramos, Pix 11 News.